Hi, my name is Chris Fuller. I'm at Red River Chevrolet in Boja City, Louisiana. Today we're going to do an interior walk around of the 2014 Corvette Stingray. Interior. Okay. The interior colors on the Corvette Stingray include jet black, adrenaline red, Kalahari, gray, and brownstone. This is the brownstone interior on a 3LT. Everything about the new C7 has been improved. This car now is the best we've seen in, in a Corvette. Everything has been improved from the seats which have had the worst reviews we can get on a car, but now the seats have bolstering in the side. They're a lot firmer than they were before. This is the regular seat for it. It also comes in a competition seat, which is a little bit more dramatic than this seat, but in a little bit thinner shell seat for the active driver. Uh, everything about this car now with the soft touch for the suede on the doors, um, the buttons here. This is a tweeter for the system, which is new. You can tell that this is a Bose system in this car. Uh, the carpeting has even changed in this car. Uh, looks like Berber carpeting. I really like that. That is new for this car for this year. Soft touch, everything about this car now is different. The head-up display in this car is comes in color now. All of your information for this car was showing the head-up display. Everything from the phone calls you make to the radio stations that you change in here. So all of that information comes into the head-up display. The controls for the head-up display are here. So you can move it up and down. You can change the information that's in the head-up display and you can lighten or darken that head-up display. This control right here would be for your uh, side view mirrors. Uh, auto headlights as in before in the other cars. Uh, the, the steering wheel has changed dramatically. It's still a leather wrapped steering wheel. Have power shifters for the transmission. This is also a, a power telescoping and tilting steering wheel. The buttons on the front here, cru cruise control on the left side and controls for your phone and for the driver information center in the dash. I'll show you that in a little bit where we now have an 8 inch screen in the dash along with your regular gauges that gives you a lot of information and it's customizable. You're able to change the look on that screen now to um, customize for your uh, driving. The, uh, there's an electronic brake in it now. Uh, no longer the, the handle brake on it, but this is electronic. It works a couple of different ways. You press this and, and uh, put it on. When you get ready to take it off, you have to touch the brake and touch it. If you actually have the car in gear and uh, try to release it and release it from gear, it will actually release that brake. So you can pull it up, release it, or put the car in gear and it release it itself. The Chevrolet MyLink system is going to be what all the rest of the industry looks at. If you go to buy a Ford and a Sync and a Uconnect and Dodge, you have to pay for those services. This service is free through Chevrolet. Uh, connectivity with your phone, with your music sources, your iPods, your MP3s, all of that stuff now it has great connectability with this car. Um, you have more than one USB port. There's storage behind this 8-inch screen here in the dash for you to put your, your uh, um, devices back there to hide. The dash cluster has changed some. This is now a digital 8-inch screen on the center there. And that screen is customizable where it gives you all of the driver info, uh, information you need uh, from the changes to performance, uh, the look of the screen from performance to track to sport mode. For any of the auto on, audio on the system, it shows in that center screen. That's 103.7. You can also change those radio stations by pressing on a knob here on the, uh, on the uh, steering wheel here and it change those radio stations. Uh, your phone, your navigation, all of that uh, comes up in the system now. So if the navigation screen is up uh, in the, on the 
system here that shows where your car is located at and all of the information associated with your navigation that will show on the heads up display and also in the um, on the 8 inch screen for the dash all of this is new for the new car this information in front of you now is invaluable for having that information right in front of you now all the time the 8 inch screen for the MyLink system is the same as I've shown you in the new Impala and the new Silverado pickup so this this system is basically the same there are some settings that are different in it the uh, uh, for the dual mode exhaust uh, it has engine sound management which it actually um, you can cut this off and it would actually work on its own so on the auto mode it works with the engine on the RPM the speed and uh, driver input to change the sound of the exhaust to also open up the dual mode exhaust and uh, it actually kicks in five horsepower by using it. The rest of the system is basically the same. Every The valet mode is in here so if you need to lock your car up you can set your radio stations. If somebody else gets in it they can't change it unless they put in the code that you use or set in here to use this system. <clears throat> Pandora the weather station, XM Weather, XM Nav Traffic, uh, OnStar, all of those systems are available in here. The navigation systems are uh, the same you uh, would use as in uh, the Silverado and the Impala. These systems now have a lot more uh, information in them including um, uh, the POIs or points of interest that you would use in a vehicle and also the uh, um, icons for stores, banks, whatever information you may need. It also puts in landmarks for places that you're at. So uh, landmarks in, the, in all parts of the country are illustrated on the screen now. This screen also has a storage area in the back of it where you can store your devices such as your phone, iPods, MP3s and such. There's also a plug-in back here for your um, USB port and, and the like in here. The system in here, the air conditioning system has heated and cooled seats. These are ventilated seats, also heated seats in them. Uh, the air conditioning system is, is pretty intuitive. It's, it's nothing hard to, to learn. On the passenger side, they also have control of their ventilated and heated seats, also the temperature on their side of the vehicle now. So this is a, this is a, a new departure from the from the old car. It's new. Everything's fresh. Everything's updated in it. Even the rearview mirror now has a frameless mold, uh, a molding around it, and it has um, uh, the icons for the OnStar in it for the uh, personal calling on star and emergency on that system. Everything is soft touch. This is a leather wrap system in, uh, in the 3LT package in here. Uh, every, this, is, this is our um, uh, trash control, stability control, and uh, suspension settings on, on this knob here. This is a, a magnetic ride select car. So you are able to tune your suspension in here, electronic parking brake in here now. So uh, you don't you don't have the handle to lift up for the parking brake. Come by Red River Chevrolet, take a look at one of these cars. Let us show you about show you all of the new features in them, and let us sell you one of these cars. So come on by Red River Chevrolet in Bossier City, Louisiana. My name is Chris Fuller. You can reach me at 318-426. 4436. Thank you.